hello good morning children today we are going to now learn about a new topic which is comparing large numbers okay now children now there are so many numbers okay they have different different values okay so what actually you will be learning over here is how will you be able to understand which value of a number is greater than the value of the other number okay like for example as you already know like 2 and 1 so amongst 2 and 1 which is the which is the greater value obviously 2 is the greater value isn't it so that's why i put a sign like this which is like if i say this is the sign means this sign shows that 2 is bigger than 1 okay children similarly if i uh, write another number like 3 and 5 so which is bigger obviously 5 is bigger so 5 has uh, 5 has to uh, towards 5 you have to show shine like this which shows actually a bigger open surface like this okay and if there is same numbers then we keep a sign equals to okay children we keep a sign equals to so this is what actually how we can compare large numbers okay large numbers now this is uh, like this is just a process how we should compare okay now i will be teaching you how to compare large large numbers okay children very large numbers okay just imagine if i give you a six digit number like this one two three four five six okay this is a this is one six digit number then again this is another six digit number one two three four five six okay so amongst this number what you have to do is first of all what you have to do is uh, like if I give you this kind of uh, or in the question if they give you this kind of question like what you have to do is first you have to see how many digits this both numbers are so this is six, six digit number see this is six digit number and the other one is also six digit isn't it so after you check this you have to see uh, like you have to see in the first place that means over here like ah, over here if you see 6 is bigger than 3 okay like if I count it from backwards 1, 10, 100, 1000, 10,000 lakh so this is 6 lakh okay and this is what 1, 10, 100, 1000, 10,000 lakh this is 3 lakhs so children obviously 6 lakh will be bigger than 3 lakh so you have to give a sign like this okay children very simple now just imagine if the digits of the number are different like for example if I give you a 5 digit number over here and if I give you 6 digit number over here okay a very small 6 digit number also if I give okay so this is 5 digit number and this is 6 digit number so when 5 digit and 6 digit number are getting compared okay if 5 digit and 6 digit numbers are getting compared then obviously children 6 digit number will be bigger okay you don't have to see the first first numbers okay you don't have to see the first numbers okay by just counting the digit numbers you can say that the number which is having more amount of digits in it will be bigger okay children very simple okay so that means what did we learn when same digits are given then you have to see the first first digit okay which was first first digits are bigger so over here when we saw the first digit this 6 was actually saying 6 lakh and this 3 was saying 3 lakhs so obviously 6 lakh is bigger than 3 lakhs okay but if there are different different number of digit the number the digit which is the number which is having less digit and the number which is having more digit okay that more digit will be bigger okay children and now if there is same numbers just imagine 6 3 5 5 and I mean 7 6 3 5 5 7 6 3 5 5 so in this case you have to give equals to because this is both five digit and same to same numbers so that's why they are equal to each other so this is how we compare digits okay children if you, <clears throat> if you have any doubt you can ask me okay so from this segment your classwork will be question number one and three okay your classwork will be 1 and question number 3. Okay. 
which is on page number 12 okay children which is on page number 12 okay and from this part only your homework will be to do question number 2 and 4 question number 2 and 4 which is also in page number 12 so this is the homework and this is, this questions are your homework and this questions are your class work so your class work you have to show me before 5 pm today okay children so if you have any doubt you can ask me regarding this in the whatsapp group the upcoming session i am discussing after some time okay in this video only okay children now this is our next topic and the last topic from block number 1 okay so over here children in this topic what we are going to do is we are going to learn what is the need for large number okay that means why do we need to learn about large numbers okay why were we not satisfied with small numbers okay now children just imagine uh, if you want to calculate the distance between earth and moon or earth and sun okay so we will not be able to use very small small values okay we will need very big values to calculate the distance between earth and moon isn't it like for example let me give you an example the distance between earth and moon okay earth and moon or you can say for now let me give an example from earth to sun okay that means this if this is earth okay if this is earth and this is sun okay so if you want to calculate what is the distance from earth to okay let me draw the figure first okay this is earth hmm so this is our earth and this is our sun okay so what is the distance between earth and sun if you want to calculate it is around how much distance you know children it is around 1496000000 okay so this is around this much kilometer okay so children if you want to calculate distance which is very very huge then we will when then we will use our uh, large numbers okay so see this is a very large number so for uh, finding the distances between planets okay or so earth and moon or earth and sun we actually use a distance uh, we use large numbers okay now as you already know how to name it so let us try to name the distance okay children so first let us see what are what is the sequence or place values of all this ones tens hundred thousand ten thousand lakh ten lakh crore ten crore so children this will be the distance between earth and sun is actually 14 crores 96 lakh okay it is how much children it is 14 crore it is 14 crores it is 14 crores 96 lakh 96 96 lakhs okay children so this much distance is between earth and moon 14 crores 96 lakhs so that's the reason why we need to know about large numbers okay children that is why we are learning our large numbers okay now let me give you some more example just imagine the distance between mercury and sun okay just imagine this is mercury okay and this is sun okay this is mercury and this is sun okay this is mercury and this is sun so if i want to find the distance between sun and mercury okay so the distance between mercury and sun is actually 5 7 9 1 0 0 0 0 kilometers okay children so now let us write the distance between mercury and sun in words so for that let us count the place values one ten hundred thousand ten thousand lakh ten lakh crores okay so this will be how much then children this will be 5 crores 
this will be 5 crores 79 lakh 79 lakhs okay 79 lakhs 10,000 10,000 okay so this will be 5 crores uh, 79 lakhs and 10,000 okay so this much is the distance between mercury and sun okay children so that is the reason why we actually have to learn the large numbers okay children so today we close or we end our first block okay so from this topic the classworks which you have to do is you have to do question number uh, three and four as your classwork okay classwork you have to do question number three and four and from this segment your homework will be question number one two and five okay one two and five will be your homework okay children so these are the things which you have to do for your assignment okay and this is the thing which you have to copy in your copies okay children so today we end our block number one okay so i expect every one of you to complete the work and submit me your work through whatsapp as soon as possible okay children and i also expect you to write all the notes which we have discussed in the board okay from day one okay and um, make your notes properly okay and write everything in uh, whatever i have ex uh, asked you to do write it in very clear and proper handwriting okay children so this video is over and block two we are going to start tomorrow okay children so here i close okay Bye-bye.